What's up? I'm Jeff Hans from Tech Bargains, and this is the video review of the Windows Phone 8X by HTC from AT&T Wireless. Typically, cell phone users look for functionality or customization in a phone instead of fashionability. However, HTC believes that you can have all three of these elements within the Windows Phone 8X, a phone that has high-end features within a sleek new package. But should you consider getting this as your brand new smartphone? Let's find out. The Windows Phone 8X that we reviewed was powered by a Qualcomm S4 1.5 GHz dual-core processor with 1 GB of RAM and 16 GB of internal storage. It featured an 8-megapixel wide-angle rear-facing camera with backside illumination for enhanced low-light performance that could capture footage at 1080p, a front-facing 2.1-megapixel camera, and a built-in Beats audio amplifier. Content was displayed on the phone's 4.3-inch Super AMOLED touchscreen display with Gorilla Glass 2 that had a native resolution of 1280 by 720. Something that stands out with the 8X is its design, which is different from other phones on the market. The sides of the device are angled to fit into your hand, while the soft rubberized coating adds a bit of a grip to the phone while also helping it to stand against an object. The phone also comes in one of four colors, black, yellow, orange, and bluish purple, which gives a bit of personalization without having to resort to an aftermarket case for the device. While the 4.3-inch display tends to stretch the phone out a bit, the button placement is nicely done as well, so interacting with the wake-sleep button, volume controls, or camera shutter was simple. We were definitely struck by the performance of the 8X, which ran great thanks to the Windows Phone OS and the dual-core processor from Qualcomm, which flew through our tests. For example, launching Spotify was almost instantaneous, and web surfing was simple. We felt that the phone came with loads of processing power, and coupled with the LTE network from AT&T, it worked extremely well. If you're in an area that has the LTE coverage, you'll experience ridiculously fast download and upload speeds. Plus, the use of data and voice simultaneously gives AT&T's network a slight edge over Verizon's, but only when you're in a coverage area. The 8X's 8-megapixel camera is simply fantastic. We found that it consistently produced good photos in bright outdoor sunlight settings as well as in low-light indoor areas. Thanks to the wide-angle lens, shots have a wider field of view than most phone cameras, while the backside illumination enhances the camera's sensitivity in low-light situations. The result lets you reduce your usage of the LED flash in photos. Plus, the 1080p video recording is excellent, so we were quite happy with the visual presentation. Were there things we didn't like? For starters, we hated the battery life of the phone, which could be described as weak at best. During typical use of the phone, like web browsing, calls, apps, etc., we could easily drain the battery by the end of the day. Standby wasn't particularly better, because the phone would drain the 1800 milliamp battery in just about four days. If you're used to charging your phone every night, it's not a big deal, but it's not the best battery around either. We also weren't impressed by the storage on the phone, which was very limited compared to other devices out there. While the device came with 16 gigabytes of storage, only 8 gigs of it was usable. HTC decided not to include a micro SD card slot on the 8X, which was possibly done to reduce weight on the device, but this restriction doesn't necessarily help people with large amounts of video or music without a dedication to micromanagement. Finally, we were initially excited to see the phone featuring Beats Audio. But while it may have seemed as though it would come with Beats headphones, it actually only has Beats audio amplification built into the device. Now that's fine because in theory, it can be used to drive larger headphones that you might own to provide a better sound experience. But we suspect that some users will be disappointed that there are no Beats earbuds included. The 8X gets most of its features right as HTC's flagship Windows phone, thanks to its striking design, powerful processor, and its wide-angle lens, which takes incredible images and video. The battery life is questionable, just as the limited storage capacity is annoying and the lack of included Beats headphones is a minor inconvenience. But all these things aside, this is still a very solid, capable Windows phone that anyone in the market for a brand new device should have on their radar. For these reasons, we decided to give the Windows Phone 8X by HTC from AT&T Wireless a 4 out of 5. For the latest coupons and deals on phones like the Windows Phone 8X, be sure to check out techbargains.com slash cellphone. To enter our monthly giveaway, make sure you always check out techbargains.com slash YouTube. And to watch our video unboxings, video reviews, and exclusive video features, be sure to go to techbargains.com slash videos.